a great full body Tabata workout that you can do from home with no equipment at all. All you'll need is a cell phone with a working time of 30 seconds of work and 10 seconds of recovery. So I'm gonna demonstrate each exercise and give you some little tips to keep in mind along the way. So like I mentioned, set your phone up, 30 seconds of work, and let's get to it. So first you're gonna lay on your back with your heels down and your toes pointing up. This is called a marching single leg hip extension. Hips elevated and you're gonna march one leg off the floor at a time. And the goal here is that we're trying to really engage the glutes and really fire from the hamstrings. You wanna prevent excessive movement in the body, so make sure to press those arms into the floor, hold for one second, and switch. Making sure to breathe in through the nose, exhale through the mouth, and rest. 10 seconds rest. The next exercise we're gonna do is called a dead bug, and this is to engage the core and really minimize any excessive motion from the spine. Start with your knees bent, and then extend the arm and opposite leg. Keep in mind that we wanna maintain light contact with your lower back against the floor, and ultimately preventing any excessive or unwanted motion in the spine. So really keep that core braced, forcefully extending the leg and opposite arm. Keep your chin down and your abs tight. 10 seconds rest. Next, we're gonna work through the chest and triceps and go into the push-up position. Spread your fingers out wide and with your legs straight, you wanna dive forward as we lower down. Forcefully exhale as we come up. The goal here is that we really want to challenge our range of motion and come as close to the floor as possible before really forcefully pressing the floor away from you. Also keeping the midsection braced. Imagine yourself like a statue here, can't be budged. And really push that floor away. 10 seconds rest. Now we're going to stand up. We're going to work the lower body with alternating step back lunges. Make sure to keep a nice tall posture, step back, stay nice and tall, and switch legs. Really important that we drive our body weight through that front foot and come up nice and tall. Breathing in as you lower down, exhaling as you come up. Forceful press in that front leg, engaging the quads, engaging the glutes, getting the heart rate up. You got this. Down up, down, up, choose your pace and rest. Next, we're gonna go into body weight squats. Stance just outside hip width apart, big toe, little toe heel, nice foot tripod, and lower down. 30 seconds, down, again, you at home, choose your pace. The goal here is to get the heart rate up, get some blood pumping through the muscles, and really engaging those legs, strong legs, guys. Down, up, make sure you keep that center pressure on the feet. Working nice and low on those squats. Breathe, exhale, breathe, exhale. Finish strong, nice work. Shake it out, guys. Last exercise, we're gonna get the heart rate going even more. These are called skater lunges. Dynamic, side to side, nice and low. Jump, down, jump, down, jump, down. Landing softly. Explosive lateral jump to the side. Down, down, down like we're skating. Stay nice and low. Explosive drive. Get that heart rate going on this last exercise. Finish strong. Up, down, up, down, low, stay low. Push, two, one. Nicely done. Rest for 10 seconds. Give yourself a two minute break and repeat four more times for five sets total. Enjoy the workout. Nice job.